look at the June issue of their, their magazine, a bunch of our startup challenge companies are featured in, in, that, um, in that magazine. Uh, Yellowscope, uh, which was in our last startup challenge. Seamus Golf, which was in our first startup challenge. Uh, Raft Syrups, uh, syrups uh, in our most recent startup challenge. And then Globe Sherpa, not one of our startup challenge companies, but, a, but they've been a company we've worked with for a few years now. They provide the mobile ticketing um, app for TriMet. They were all featured in our in, in Alaska Airlines getting some some good press. Um, uh, and then a couple just upcoming things. Well, so the 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 Lentz uh, International Farmers Market kicked off. That started at the um, on the 31st of May, and so that's now open throughout the rest of the summer. And and the International Farmers Market uh, operates right in Lentz Town Center on one of our properties right next door to the goats. And uh, so that, that is um, open now every Sunday from 10 a.m. to 3 p.m. That's at 92nd and, uh, uh, and Foster. Right nearby, um, Zenger Farm um, is having their grand opening for the Urban Grange, which is the new building that they've built on the Zenger Farm site. We provided $300,000 of, of money to help get that project off the ground. That grand opening is is uh, at Friday, June 26th. So it's nice to see that that happening. And then um, the last thing that's just to highlight is the J District Night Market has announced their summer dates, uh, August two weekends in August, like August 15th and I think August 22nd. And what's exciting about that is that I don't know if anybody made it to the Gen to the J District Night Market last year, but they had it in the parking lot of Fubon on 82nd, and it was just it was an incredible event, and and but it was packed. I mean, the, the um, uh, thousands of people kind of squeezed into a to a little part of the parking lot. They they now have P, uh, PCC's Southeast Campus has agreed to host the, the night market. And in addition to that, they're closing off that portion of 80 of division between 80th and 82nd for the night market. So the night market's gonna be huge this year, but it's in August and right now they're looking for vendors. So any vendors who wanna, who wanna apply can, um, uh, uh, can do so now and, um, and, and you know, it's a great event to get exposure if you're a food vendor or, or sell some other, other products. Um, I think you can go to the J District website or their Facebook page if, to, to find out more information on that. So that's it.